Hi, I'm Dr. Natalie Betiture, and today I'd like to talk to you about making the most of your resources. So these days we live in a wonderful time where there's internet and there's so many different resources online for free. So I think what's important first is to understand what type of media you prefer. Do you like videos? Do you like articles? Do you like books? Do you prefer YouTube? Do you like it when your friends WhatsApp you videos or big documents or interesting things? Do you like the quotes on like a picture with someone? You need to understand what type of media resonates with you and how you like to engage. Do you like Twitter? Do you like Facebook? Do you like emails? And figure out what you're most comfortable with because then you can use that as your primary source of information and then use your time to find which are the places I like in this media type and then see what resonates with you. Who are the kinds of people you like to hear from? Is it famous people? Is it academics? Is it rich people? What is the kind of person that connects with you or you understand or you see yourself in and how do you like to receive that media from them? I also think it's important to try and get, take advantage of all the different free things you can have whether it's YouTube or subscribing to free newsletters. Right now there's so many webinars that people can just register for and you get to hear experts talk about something. You need to understand what you find trends, find something in common in all the different types of media that you like, which are the videos that you send to people or the podcast or you say, oh, this is such a great show, you should listen to it. Try and see what you like about it so it helps you to filter and find more people like that. The other way to do that is also to share. If you have a network of friends who you always share, let's say banking tips or savings tips, or this is how you do online marketing, find a group of people and you share different resources. That way, whichever, whatever any of you stumbles upon, you can share within you. Then you can discuss it, you can learn more. And don't just take things for granted. Like when you, someone sends you a song and you really like it, but you've never heard of that artist. Some people go now to that artist and look at all the other things that they had ever sung to see if you like it. That's an easy way to find more stuff that resonates with you. If you get a video of Michelle Obama talking and you're like, wow, this has really hit me and I really like her and I'm listening so well, then Google Michelle Obama. Go and watch other videos of her talking or see what she, her message is. Read about her. You never know what else you'll find along the way. You have to think of it like a mind map where the kind of person or the kind of media you like, what comes out of there. If they call it a YouTube hole, sometimes you go and watch one video on YouTube, then YouTube will recommend something that's similar. And then you watch that and then it recommends again and you watch that and you keep going down this deep, deep hole of time because all these videos are similar. So you need to try and find those holes for you. That way you can absorb more information in an easy and convenient way. If you like these videos, please subscribe, share with your friends.